So over here you can see that I have my main track right here and if I were to click and drag it out you can see that everything actually auto snaps right here. But if I were to go around and keep it in the other layer then you can see that I can actually have a gap in between these clips right here. But in first layer right here you can see that I don't have that option right here but I may want that option. In that case what you can do is you can go around and turn off the main track magnet. So what that does is it turns off the magnet and now I will be freely able to um, adjust out the clips wherever I want right here. So just like this you can see that I can go around and have the traditional timeline as in other editors where I have gaps in between as you can see right here. But when you're working like this you do need to be careful because you might just leave out some empty spots. And you want to turn that back again uh, that is the main uh, track magnet then simply click right here and everything comes together as you can see right here and all the gaps and everything gets deleted and you have all the uh, clips right here snapping around over here onto the main timeline as you can see just like this. So that is how you can work around with the main track magnet inside of CapCut desktop editor. So I hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe.